Welcome to the US Open. Count from 10 to 5 and you'll go at 5. Have a great ride. Good luck. 8, 7, 6, 5, go. Cool thing about the US Open is anybody can step up and race pro. It's a chance for local kids, shredders, anybody to get a chance at racing against the big names in the sport. We start off with the open class downhill race. We have an amateur class downhill race as well. And we do a Enduro, open and amateur as well. And then we have our adaptive race, our Grand Bomb which is a youth downhill race on a, on a proper downhill track. It's a real race for kids. The, the showstopper is the best whip contest we do. In the open class downhill, the prize is pretty big. It's $6,000 to the winner. And that's on par with some of the most elite races in mountain biking and it's going to continue to grow every year it gets a little bit bigger. You know, we had a, a decent World Cup showing, so we had some of the best riders in the world. We had the men's French national champion, the men's and women's U.S. national champions, men's and women's Canadian national champions here. We had former U.S. Open winners here. The energy at the race this weekend was incredible. I had riders telling me that they heard USA chanting in the woods. There was people with noisemakers and screaming fans everywhere. It was exactly what we had hoped it would be. And the riders were stoked. The US Open is famous for having some pretty aggressive tracks. It started out with one of the most rowdy start gates I've ever raced and I've been racing for a long time. Right out of the start gate, you, you know, you have that reaction to pedal really hard, but then, you know, one pedal stroke later, you're going down a super steep hill, so it's right on the brakes, and, and then from there on out, it was just a fresh cut, and it just kept getting steeper and steeper the whole time. Your arms were hurting four minutes in, and it just kept, kept giving. It was getting more challenging as you go. The hardest thing on the track is to try and keep the momentum. It's like as soon as you go slower, it's actually harder. So you're trying to keep the speed, but a lot of the ruts had gone this afternoon. So it was, it was a challenge. It, you have your feet off quite a bit of the time and uh, just riding the seat, but got down the hill, so it was good. We definitely would like to keep the US Open at Killington. The new track that we put in off the K1 Summit is amazing. We have a few tweaks we can make to improve it. So it's only going to get better and it's a great track, so we absolutely want to come back for it.